So in today's video, we're gonna take a look at the new Torch USB microphone by Rocat, or as some of you might call it, Rocket. I wanna thank the guys at Rocat for sending this over to review on the channel. This one's currently just under 100 bucks, but I'll leave a link in the description of the video with current pricing and more information. It's got mixer style controls right on the base of the microphone. And of course, this one has RGB lighting. You got 24 bit audio. Now you've got dual condenser capsules on this one, reactive RGB lighting, and three selectable pickup patterns. This one also has an integrated pop filter. Now they're calling this contactless S, quick mute on the top of the microphone. If you wave your hand over it, it mutes the microphone. So let's go ahead and open it up and see what we've got. And in case you're wondering, this one does work with a boom arm. So in the box, of course, you're gonna get a quick start guide, USB-C to USB-A braided cable. And then you're also gonna get a USB-C to USB-C cable. Then you've also got a USB-C to USB-C adapter that actually plugs the microphone into the base. Okay, this actually looks really good. Pretty much an all metal construction. Then you have a metal plate there on the top and then the bottom is made of plastic. You can see the microphone also rotates left and right and you can even tilt it back a little bit or just keep it straight up and down. Now your controls down here is where you turn the power on, pick which pattern you wanna use. And then of course the volume is in the middle and then your mic gain is on the right. On the back, you've got a 3.5 millimeter jack, USB-C port, which is gonna go to your PC and then a USB-C that's gonna go to the microphone. You also have a distance adjuster for the mute on the top so you can decide how far away it senses your hand going above it. You've also got an LED brightness toggle where you can choose between 25%, 50, 75, 100% or just turn the LEDs off altogether. You can also mute the microphone just by pushing in the volume knob. This is the mic test for the Rocat Torch USB microphone. This is a dual condenser capsule design with 24 bit audio. Now probably one of the coolest things about this microphone is the RGB lighting, not only in the middle of the microphone, but along the sides as well, as you turn the gain up and down. And I like that you can mute it on top of the microphone or just by pushing in the volume knob. Don't forget you also have three pickup patterns on this microphone, including the exclusive whisper. Okay, so the color on the microphone actually changes depending on which polar pattern you're in. The pickup pattern you're currently listening to is right in the middle. Let's go ahead and turn it to the left one and see what we got. Again, this is a mic test for the Torch USB microphone by Rocat, or as some like to call it, Rocket. Now let's go ahead and turn the pickup pattern all the way to the right and see what the difference is. Now I notice once you switch this to the whisper mode, I can tell already the gain really jumped up high. Obviously that makes sense so you don't have to talk as loud. You know, if you're trying to game while someone's sleeping next to you. So I do almost have to whisper, otherwise I'm gonna talk way too loud. Let's turn that down a little. This is a mic test currently in the whisper mode. One thing to keep in mind is the color of the RGB lighting on the microphone will tell you which polar pattern you're on. If it's blue, that means you're on the whisper setting, green is cardioid, and then purple is stereo. And again, this is a mic test for the Rocat Torch USB microphone. This is also compatible with boom arms. It's 24 bit audio. Nice thing is you've got two different ways to mute the microphone. You can sort of wave your hand over it at the top. You've got the contactless quick mute, which you can just sort of hover your hand over at the top, or you can just push the button right down on the volume knob. And you can see the RGB lighting go up and down on the sides of the microphone. Definitely one of the coolest features on this USB mic. This is a mic test for the Torch USB microphone and this is in the cardioid setting. Now I'm going to switch over to stereo mode and see if it sounds any different. Now this is a mic test for the Rocat Torch USB microphone and we're currently in the stereo mode. Again, purple lights mean you're in stereo, green is cardioid, and blue is whisper. Let me know down below which you think sounds better. Okay, my first impressions of the Rocat Torch USB microphone is yeah, this thing is actually pretty nice. 
build quality, style, functionality, everything feels and looks really good. The only issue I've had from time to time is for some reason the microphone is muted and I'm not sure if it's supposed to do that and maybe it was just sitting for too long or it just goes into mute automatically if it's sitting there. I'm not really sure. But there was a couple times when it was in whisper mode where the microphone was muted and I was like, hey, I didn't try to mute the mic. So I don't know, maybe it can be fixed in a software update or maybe that's just something that's built into the microphone. One thing that was a little confusing to me with this microphone is because you have a 3.5 millimeter jack on the back, I thought that was like a mic monitoring system, but from what I can tell, no, you can just hear the audio on your computer through that jack, which I guess is a good thing. I was just thinking that because I was wearing headphones, it was a mic monitor system, not an extension to hear the audio from your computer. Either way, I guess it's good that you have the headphone jack on there. Just something that I thought I would point out. But if you're looking for a USB microphone for either streaming, podcast, music, gaming, YouTube videos, basically whatever you would need a USB microphone for, yeah, you should definitely check this one out. So if you've made it this far into the video, you may want to say thanks by subscribing and don't forget to give a thumbs up if this video was helpful. This is Brian from Fishbee Productions. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm.